this ability that's given. An ability is to recognize your unique power in the gifts that have been given to you. As we read earlier in Corinthians, Paul says it's, it's unique to each of us, but each of us, it's needed. And it's in each of us these unique gifts, gifts that are poured out that actually makes up the body of Christ. See, it's our diversity that makes us stronger. It's those different gifts in each of us that strengthens us of his power that's been given to our lives. That's the ability that God has put into our lives. And finally, there's an action. And the action is using your gifts for the Lord's higher purpose. And the Lord's higher purpose for each of our lives is the building up of the body of Christ. That's the highest purpose. It's how do I be part of the body of Christ to continue to build that up? How do I bring what's been imparted in my life that becomes a way that I'm a witness to the world and a way that I serve within the community? That's that greater work. And the greater that we're working together, the greater the world will see the work within us. See, the world needs the Holy Spirit. The world needs the power of love, compassion, understanding, and service. And Jesus' intention was that the world would come to know by the way that we lived out our life in him. That the world would come to know. God's plan to demonstrate this power is through all those who believe. That he would be made known to the world. Let this feast of Pentecost be a time of renewal or recommitment to living lives that are empowered by the Holy Spirit.